join us with the Army because we're one of the unique jobs where Army does not have a AFC or in their case an MOS that is a weather job. So we actually do all weather support for all the Army and Air Force. Bravo Team Assault! And then this, then the soldier skills portion uh, is new to this course. That's the big addition uh, to the course is a uh, bringing them up to ba the basic level of an Army soldier when he gets out of basic training. Because if you, you know the Army's uh, first job is to be a soldier, whereas the Air Force's first job is to be a technician. But they still need those soldier skills so that they're not a liability to their Army customer. It's one thing to do it on paper and learn about it, and then uh, it's another thing to actually execute it. And uh, definitely executing it was fun, but yet eye-opening. They're having to learn a lot real quick. But one of the advantages of having a very mixed group is a lot of them are learning from each other and they're kind of helping coach each other through it. When it's all said and done here, what I'll take away is really a greater appreciation for what uh, my Army brethren have and uh, what the other um, battlefield weather forecasters have done before. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm new. I'm brand new. I haven't done this. And so definitely this is what my uh, forefathers did. I, I guess I get to follow in their footsteps and I have greater appreciation for what they do on a day-to-day -day basis and uh, this will help me better support my army customer when it comes to doing the weather for them.